In this video, I'll show you how to reset your Brother HLL2460DW. In case you're having issues with the Wi Fi or any other issues, I'll show you how to do it. So, first thing, we're gonna press this back button once. You're gonna see general setup over here. With these arrows, you're gonna press them a few times until you see on the screen printer. Then press the OK button. Gonna press these arrows again to shuffle through these settings until you see reset printer. Then press OK. And now all it's left to do is to press the down arrow once. Wait a few seconds, it will set default settings, and this is it. Your printer has been reset. Now, if you were watching this video to know how to reset the toner count in case your printer does not allow you to print, but because it says that you need to replace the toner, but you know that there's still ink left in it, I'll show you how to do it. So to reset the toner count, uh, first thing, make sure that your printer is turned off. Then you're going to open the door over here where the toner cartridge is like that, leave it open until I tell you to close it. Then we need to go on the control panel. Under control panel, we need to turn on the printer by pressing the go button and holding the power button during about two seconds. Then release the power button and keep your finger press on the go button for another three seconds. So let me demonstrate. I'll use two fingers since it's easier to show you. So I'm keeping both press one, two, then I release the power button, I keep it for three more seconds, and then I release this button. On the display over here, you should see user's mode. Next step is to press this go button 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Make a five seconds pause. Two, three, four, Five, and now press it five times. One, two, three, four, five. On the screen over here, you're going to see something appearing. Please wait. And after just two seconds, the toner count has been reset. Now it's time to close the, the door over here on the front. Wait a few seconds and you'll be able to print with your toner count reset it. This is a great thing to do if uh, there's still ink left in into your toner, but your printer tells you to uh, switch with a new cartridge. This is a waste, I think, and by resetting it the way I showed you, you'll be able to continue printing until there's no more ink inside. So thanks for watching. If you want to support my channel, check the Amazon affiliate links in the description down below. If you want to get some toner for your brother printer or even some paper or other stuff. If not, just leave a like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you in the next video.